sure that looked bad, but I mean, put that car inside an arena and ask Del Rio to drive five miles an hour for like 10 feet. The guy nails it every time. We all know there's gold on the ceiling, just make sure you're tall enough to reach it. Right, Del Rio? Once again, this guy has everything it takes to be the franchise player in the WWE. He's rich, he's regal, he has a butler, he's old, boring, and of course, most importantly of all, he's tall. And he's slouching. At least it looks like it with his shirt off. This guy gets more chances than I get bro kicks to my face and I still look like a manly Brad Pitt. Think Fight Club, not all the adopted kids. I guess saying it's your destiny and smiling is much more entertaining than say, I don't know. Being the only John Wayne left in this town because everyone has their head so far up there, you know what, that they lose sight of the real goal of sports entertainment. Sports and entertainment. I'll be damned if I don't go out there every single night and be on a shadow of a doubt. Prove it. And I'm sure as hell not going to stop now when I'm this close. This close to showing the world what true talent, true dedication, true yearning to be the best, to be the measuring stick, to be what it takes to be the greatest sports entertainer in the history of this business. Not the champ. Not the franchise, but the absolute best ever comes from within. Not being written by a writer, not having gimmicks, quirks, simply being the best in every aspect there is and going to sleep at night knowing that what I did was simply better and that I always did it my way. I did it my way. Or, you know, something, 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 innuendo, whatevs.